Harvey Biso has completed its first subsea project performing saturation diving work in 105 meter of water at the ATP Oil and Gas Corporation's Deepwater Platform in Grand Isle Block 115. Harvey Biso used the Harvey Discovery, a DP2 certified multi-purpose support vessel outfitted with a 300-meter portable 12-man saturation diving system to perform the operation. Transocean has released an update regarding a fire and explosion on board its semi-submersible drilling rig Deepwater Horizon, saying that the rig sank late on April 22. The combined response team was not able to stem the flow of hydrocarbons prior to the rig sinking. Diamond Offshore Drilling has reported a net income of the first quarter of 2010 of 290.9 million US dollars or $2.09 per share on a diluted basis, compared with a net income of 348.6 million US dollars or $2.51 per share on a diluted basis in the same period a year earlier. Revenues on the first quarter of 2010 were 859.7 million US dollars compared with the revenues of 885.7 million US dollars for the first quarter of 2009. But that's all for now. Do come back later for more.